Okay, YouTube, welcome back to Dwarf Fortress 2014 with the Flying Fit. This is Night Hall, uh, episode uh, 60, 60 something? 61? 60! No, 61. It is 61. Um, where was the. There he is. I knew I had seen one somewhere. I also see one over here. I'm really getting tired of doing this. I know I said that before, and I was like, it's time to do something about it, but I didn't get to it. Ah! Here we go. Once I remove this armor stand, are you guys going to realize you have to go somewhere else? No. You're going to stay right there. Are you guys from the same squad? This is Asab and Gebtun. Asab, Asab Sabosh or something like that and Gebtun. So you are. You are both in Training Platoon Bravo. Okay, and Training Platoon Bravo is right here. Training Platoon Bravo. Position. Oh, right, this is their translated names, that's why. Um, there they go, they're leaving finally. They're moving on. They're getting on with their life. Why do I have an Axe Lord hauling stuff, though? Axe Lord. You have no hauling labors turned on. You should be doing not hauling. Maybe it's a holdover from before. We'll see. See if that gets sorted. Uh, smoothing done? Almost. I think the floor is the last little bits of floor being done and then it's just a few chunks of wall. One more chunk of wall. There we go. So it's all getting worked on. So I'm going to go ahead and designate this to get dug out. And that will start the work on my... Oh, went the wrong way. No. There we go. So that'll get the work started on this. Now, just in case something comes up and I need to change what they're doing, I'm going to kind of do it in sections. Here we're going to be divided in the middle. Which is not a bad idea. Maybe I'll divide them all up in the middle. Except the first one, of course. Because that would be silly. I'm doing two upward areas at once. Though I suppose I don't have to. But that's fine. One little tiny little bit of smoothing to do. So the sheep that was born was obviously a male sheep. Oh, there were several sheep born. It's interesting. Interesting indeed. Let's take a look at that, shall we? Go ahead in here. Unassign the stray lamb. Come down to here. We will unassign the stray lamb. Come down to here and we will unassign the stray lamb. Now I'm waiting for the male one to get butchered. And then I can just assign the ones that are not uh, assigned to a pasture otherwise, right? Oh, that's obviously the male one right there. Here he goes. He's almost butchered. And I can get on with my life. Oh, excuse me. Slaughtered. Okay. Uh, so this has nothing assigned to it. Let's go ahead and assign a stray lamb. This one has nothing assigned to it. We'll go ahead and assign a stray lamb. That horse I want to butcher. Where is it? There he is. Butcher the horse. The only... Oh, I, I was going to say the only useful thing the dwarves brought me, but that's not a fair statement to make at all. 
They brought me lots of useful things, they just been, didn't bring me the bins that I wanted. The bin after bin after bin. Uh, how's the floors? Oh, well, look at that, the floors are done. So let's put in a wooden wall over here. Out of wood. I even said a wooden wall. And then let's go ahead and build a floor down here. Should have done that the other way. I'm going to go ahead and cancel this wall and redesignate it because I want the wall to get done first. Oh, there we go. Yep. Yep. Another lamb has been born. Was it a female lamb? It was a male lamb, so it's going to die soon. It's training outside anymore. There's no more random clothes lying around in there. So let's go ahead and get the lever. There we go, and someone's going to get started. So here we go. You ready, recruits? And it begins. Bam. Outstanding. I love it. Uh, loves it. And here we go. Holy smokes, they're already almost done this. That's amazing. It is amazing to me how quickly they can dig when they put their mind to it. But this is good because we're going to uncover more gems and more ore and all kinds of good stuff like that. Thing of beauty. Don't go too far. There you go. Do this one now. Yeah, I knew that lamb was not long for this world. Wow, look at that. That wall is almost done. Oh, that reminds me. I do want to... Get that dig get dug out as well. I almost said digged out. I want I want that digged out. I want it digged out right now. There you go, last bit of walls going in, so let's go ahead and uh, I want this hallway to go in as well. There we go. Floor for the hallway. Guys are already getting better. And actually, something that I neglected to do, my platoons are bigger now. If we go in here, platoon A has four, platoon B has four, and the Ambraxis has four. So we go to the schedule, we need to edit the orders here and make it minimum soldiers four. Shift enter done, copy. And paste them across the board for training platoon A. Paste that across the board for training platoon B. And same thing for my amber axes. Good. What? I'm confused now. A is set for active training, B is set for active training, C is set for active training. So why are they all stopping? Oh, there we go. It just took them a minute to realize what was going on. Well, now there's clothes lying in there again. Darn it. Stop pulling the lever. Until the clothes are removed. Oh, did someone just go pick it up? It looks like it's already been removed. To my eyes. Looks like the clothing has already been removed. Let me double check that real quick. Yeah, clothing. Okay, so someone has obviously come and grabbed it. No problem. Back down. Unsuspend. There you go. Buddy's coming to do it already. Start dodging. Here they come.
stick up Florin, actually. Should have made that bigger. There you go. Good. Uh, and then it will be... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7... If I do like 1, 2, 3, 4, 4 beds from 4 beds... And then in the middle here... We can put... Uh, we can put like weapon racks and armor stands on the sides. And then put like chests. Actually, I'll just put chests at the foot of their beds. Oh yeah, just like the just like the other thing. And that would be the barracks. Beauty. Uh, is this guy still building all his? No. Why, hey, carpenter? What uh, what's your deal, buddy? You are a carpenter. Are you not locked inside the burrow? Is that the problem? That is the problem. And which wasn't? I, I think it's the it's Babak, right? Yes, it is Babak. So Babak, sir, remain in the burrow and make the wooden things in uh, in large quantities. Oh, this is a problem now, though, right? Because the burrow includes the building of the floor. So I need to go back into this burrow. Oh, it doesn't include where the floor is going to be built. That was silly me. How exactly were the doors supposed to get here? <laughs> Alright, we will remove. We will erase burrow. The industry burrow does not include this layer. There's nothing here for them. Nothing here for them. But the floor is all done. Or is this here? Yep, I'm, I'm currently removing, right? Remove, yes, currently erasing. I think these are below, but let's find out. They are below. That's good. Good. So the carpenter is now locked inside. Perfect. Good effect, though. Good. Lots of building going on. I'd like to see that. What? I don't know who was talking there, but carry on. Hey, cool. Who is that? Is it just random? Is that like the dodging sound? Guy talks now? Why have I never heard that before? Swing miss. Is, is like the whip sound, quite obviously. I don't know what that talking was about. I'm just gonna pretend it never happened. I didn't hear anything, I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, I don't know. The voice hasn't come back, so... Oh. What, uh, what is the gender? It is a male. Well, it's not long for this world. Uh, 17 idlers. Let's take a look. Miners are idle. Of course they're idle. Uh, I should have known that they were idle. I'm a fool. Here we go. I have another section. Is my uh, carpenter now carpentering? It looks like it. Yep. Good. Oh wow, and he took care of a lot of stuff. So what did I need? I needed two more chairs and five doors, right? So that's one, two, three, four, five doors. So I still need two chairs. Two more chairs. Where's he 
You need like eight pieces of wood to make one bit one door. Ooh. I understand. He was finishing the repeated tasks, and they just keep rotating back to the bottom. That makes perfect sense. I'm obviously just wasn't paying attention. And then I needed two chairs. There we go. So once those two chairs are made, in fact, let me move them up in the priority queue. Once these two chairs are made, I'm going to go ahead and build the... Uh, uh, noble room. These guys are almost done, so I'm just going to go ahead and preempt them finishing by designating another thing. Yeah, once that's all done, I can go ahead and, and put the furniture in that noble room. It obviously won't be quite ready for somebody yet, because there's nobody who needs it, but when they do, I'll be all set. So there's just two chairs I'm waiting on. And of course, it all has to get hauled as well, so. A lot of storage junk, but I'm hoping to get some migrants here pretty soon. It is mid spring. So at some point in the next few months, we should get a migrant. nice to see entire farms full too. That just goes to show like we, we have been doing this for so long we now have enough seeds to fill up our entire farms. It's beautiful. It brings a tear to my eye. How are you guys doing? Holy smokes you finished that too. You guys are not messing around. Well frankly if that's how quick you're gonna be then there's no point doing this in sections. You're gonna be done in no time. would make more sense to do the smoothing in sections. Uh, although there's really no reason to do that if we're being completely honest about it. Which, you know, I have no reason to lie. I might as well be honest about it, right? Uh, floors, how are they coming? Oh, they're coming nicely. Look at that. They're becoming even nicer when I get another migrant wave and can get more haulers. Because I'm going to have a lot of haulers, a lot of carpenters, and a lot of... Um, Masons. Good, a replacement for the baby that we killed. This is not the baby of a... No, it's a gem cutter's baby. Good. As long as it's not a warrior's baby. That's what matters. Oh, oh, there are... Someone left a cloak sitting in the danger room. No. Uh, I'm going to leave it because it's the not very dangerous danger room, and if somebody wanders in there and gets injured, it will just be practice for my doctor. I don't think it will kill them. Oh, is it, maybe this guy's coming to pick it up? No. No, he's not. I'm really waiting for someone to... Ah! Oh, excellent. That is excellent. I'm very anxious to find out what type of migrants we got, but we'll find out in a future episode. For now, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.